Hello everybody, welcome back to today's tutorial video on Antipot. This is one of our older plugins that I actually updated literally a moment ago um, today. Uh, you'll be seeing this video about three days after the update releases, but I wanted to create a video because I've never shown this one off and I think you'll enjoy it. I'm sorry if I sound a little out of it. I'm currently sick and I'm really not feeling well, so I probably shouldn't be recording, but I have to record for this week's videos. So Antibot is a plugin which works on 1.5. 8 through 1.14 ignore that it says 12 um, it keeps bots from sending commands and messages when they join the server so they have to move before they type anything which can be very useful um, let me all you have to do is download a drop in your plugins folder and restart your server then you get this useful config file where you can change all the messages and change if you want a um, update notification if you do you just go ahead and enable it if not you disable it um, then as you see you have a bypass so if I join the server and I have the bypass permission that I don't move I can type but if I join the server with a non bypass permission account I am unable to type any messages and I'm unable to type any commands because I've not moved so it cancels everything and then once I move it works and then I could use your commands but if I don't I can't use any commands or type any messages until you move around which keeps bots who are like um, joining the server and like they type join my IP test.bghdevelopment.com um, so they, they'll join oh god <laughs> so they'll join and like spam this but our plugin blocks it because they're a bot, they're unable to move, but if they move, they can type it, but they won't be able to move because they're bots, unless it's an actual person and you join, because normal people would join and then start moving around before typing, but bots just go join and spam, so this stops that. It's quite helpful. People have enjoyed it, and if you have questions on how to use it, please let me know by leaving a comment on this video or joining our Discord, and I'd be happy to help you out on setting this up or getting any issues you have with it an update was released two days ago like I said um, by the time you're watching this fixing a few issues and getting it to work on the new spigot versions if you have any questions on how to use the plugin please let me know down in the comments or leave a message on our discord server if you, um, and have a great day I'll see you in tomorrow's video I'm sorry I sound a little sick and I will see you tomorrow goodbye